What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to boost your frame rate and overall performance when playing Forza Horizon 4 on your PC. This guide will be aimed at low to mid NPCs. Everything you need will be listed in the description below. Before making any changes to your settings, I suggest to use the benchmark mode first. This will take 2 to 3 minutes to automatically set your settings to your PC's performance. To further increase your performance, navigate to your video settings. Here in the basic tab, make sure to enable the dynamic optimization option, which will in turn adjust your video settings depending on the game's utilization. Below, set the dynamic render quality option to low or medium, depending on your system specs. I suggest to try some of these settings out while in game to see what works best for you. Set the resolution to your native monitor resolution. In case none of the other changes helped you out as much as you wanted, then you can slightly reduce the resolution. This will in any case reduce the visual quality, but your performance will increase in any way. Make sure to cap your frame rate to 60 in case you struggle to even reach 60 FPS. For 144Hz monitor users, you should unlock your FPS cap. Disable VSync and make sure to play in full screen mode. I have set it to windowed as it's easier to record. Set the brightness option to your liking. Enable the FPS counter to benchmark any changes while playing the game. I prefer to disable motion blur, but this will also come down to personal preference. The other basic video settings will have no impact on your performance. In the advanced section, set the preset to low, which will by default lower all of the other advanced settings. Disable shadows, as these will often be quite distracting when lowering the resolution, as well as the shader quality option. When this is done, leave the game running and open up your task manager. Here in the processes tab, right click Forza Horizon 4 and select to go to details. In the details tab, the Forza Horizon 4.exe application should be highlighted. Simply right click it and set the priority to high. This will in turn allocate more resources to playing the game and should increase your performance, especially if you have other programs running in the background. In order to reduce the CPU utilization from other applications, I suggest you to end some processes from running in the background in the Processes tab, which you don't need when playing the game. But make sure to only add programs from running, which you know won't break your operating system. You can now close the game at your task manager. Make sure that your peripherals and other devices are running the latest driver. In some cases, outdated driver software for your components can be the culprit of stuttering or FPS drops. Search for Device Manager in your taskbar search to open it up. On this window, expand mice and other pointing devices. Right click the device you are using, select Update Driver and then search automatically for updated driver software. In case you are unsure about which device you are currently using, then repeat this step for each device. You should also update your network adapter, display adapter and disk drivers. When this is done, close this window and make sure that your graphics driver and operating system is up to date. This step can make the biggest performance difference, depending on how often you are updating your drivers. In case you are using an Nvidia graphics card, then I suggest using the GeForce Experience application. Otherwise, you can also use the AMD driver suit. In the Drivers tab, simply click on Download and the application will automatically download and install the latest driver. In the Home tab, select Details for Forza Horizon 4 and then select this wrench icon. This allows you to optimize some options for performance when using this slider system. You can in addition also change your resolution and display mode from here. Lastly, in your settings under General, Make sure that the in-game overlay is turned off. This can in some cases result in random lag when enabled, especially on systems running on a low-end CPU. You can now close this window and search for update in your taskbar search to open up your search for updates system settings window. Here, make sure to download the latest update and restart your PC to install it. When this is done, 
We will change some OS settings, which are usually turned on by default and could reduce your overall performance, especially when using demanding applications. Search for Game Bar to open up the Game Bar system settings. Here, uncheck the recording option, and in the Captures tab, make sure to additionally disable the background recording option. These settings will only reduce your performance. If you want to record your gameplay, then I suggest using OBS Studio or an external capture card, if you lack performance. Again, in your settings, look up Startup to open up your Startup Apps options. Here, you should disable apps from automatically starting up on System Boot. Especially applications such as Skype or Discord can be taxing to your overall system performance and should be enabled when you actually plan to use them. Next, we will change a few settings in your NVIDIA control panel. Right-click your desktop and select to open it up. Here, navigate to Manage 3D Settings and then Program Settings. Select to add a program to customize and then add Forza Horizon 4 from the program list. Below, we will change a few settings. Make sure that the CUDA setting is set to your main GPU. Set the power management mode to prefer maximum performance and set the texture filtering quality to performance. Make sure to apply your changes as this will improve the game's performance when using a low-end graphics card. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.